Trevor, you've been through a bunch of playoff races in your career. What is it like when you come down, now you have 10 games remaining, every game has incredible meaning. What's this time of the year like? And, and what's it like to try to get your maximum focus after a couple of missteps like Atlanta and then tonight? Um, well, obviously we know every game counts right now, especially with this playing situation. Um, you know, the losses that we have, had over these last couple of games. They are what they are. Um, we didn't play our best ball, um, but we can't worry about what's happened in the past. We have to focus on these last 10 and play them like uh, like our, you know, our playoff lives depending on them because they do. Um, the seating is important. So whatever we do, you know, we have to do it uh, knowing that, you know, we can be in the playing situation or we can be uh, seated and, and set and ready to go. You guys had been very good in clutch situations for a while. It's sort of, it's, you know, especially it seemed like it was going well in that direction. Is there anything tonight in the fourth quarter? Was it just fatigue of having to rely on so many of your key guys with so many guys out? What happened in a fourth quarter like this tonight? Man, uh, they out rebounded us a lot. It's never, it never, uh, it never, it's never just one quarter that a team beats you usually is it's throughout the whole game. Um, and tonight, you know, they, they beat us up on the glass. We turned the ball over a lot. Um, we didn't play uh, the way that we played uh, last time against them. Thank you. All right, next we go to Cooper Moorhead. Trevor, um, not in every game, but a lot of games lately, there's you guys have gotten off to a really good defensive start. The deflections are all there, steals. You guys are getting out in transition. And then some of these games, there's pockets where the other team seems to adjust. And is it just the other team adjusting and cleaning up their ball movement, or is there defensive slippage as the game goes on? Is it one or the other? I just think it's a combination of both. Um, when you give a team a steady diet or something, you know, these are professional players with IQs. They, you know, they make adjustments, they figure things out. And playing in a situation as such, uh, you know, we just played them Monday, what is it? Whatever today, we just played them what, Saturday. So um, they were pretty prepared for what we do. They had an idea of what we were going to do and made adjustments.